Setting up a sidechain input in Cubase Pro 10 has been made much simpler. Before, a lot of people would be confused as to where to put the sidechain, how to route to the input to key the sidechain. So let's take a listen to an example here where we have a synth bass and a kick drum. And I wanted the kick to act as a sidechain input for the compressor on the synth. So what I would do is come here, we'll open up our dynamics and we'll just choose our standard plug in here for compression. I will now apply the compression and let's activate the side chain. New in Cubase Pro 10 is the ability of this icon directly to the right of the side chain. And now we could choose our side chain input from your list. And if you wanted to add additional tracks, you could do that as well. So now my kick is going to be the side chain input directly for the compressor that's already been opened up for this particular track. So let's listen to it. So you can see now that setting up your side chains is easier than ever before in Cubase Pro 10. If you have found this video helpful, please feel free to like the video and to subscribe to the channel.